Have you experienced being isolated? Yeah, you were put in isolation. Kumbaga, ang tawag dun ay Bartolina. Binartolina. <laughs> isolation. Hi, this is Brother Eng sa ating one word encounter. And the word for today is quarantine. <laughs> Kala nyo Bartolina, no? Quarantine. Yes! Yun ang nangyayari sa atin ngayon. Kailangan natin sundin. Yung, why do we need to be quarantined? Why? Yeah. For your sake and for the sake of others. Halimbawa, you've got symptoms. Diba? So, you quarantine yourself, you isolate yourself, you, 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 you separate yourself from others so that hindi ka makahawa. Diba? Yung iba kasi matigas ang ulo. May symptom na nga. Ayan, talagang nakikipaghalubilo pa sa iba. Yan, sa atin, lalo sa ating panahon. No? Kailangan natin sundin yung quarantine, ibartulina ka. You know what? Pag nangyari sa iyo yan, uh, take it as a cue that you are going into a retreat with God. That's why we have a program, Quarantine Out with God. Quarantine Out with God. It's actually the quarantine time okay, of being with God. Why don't you take that as a cue? Okay, maybe you need to have that personal retreat. 14 days ang quarantine natin because of the, the, the COVID-19. 14 days ang required na quarantine. Although binaba na nila to 10 days, meron pang iba 7 days, whatever. Basta ang kailangan lang is magkaroon ng isolation magkaroon ng being separated from the rest para hindi na makahawa. Yun naman ang purpose ng being quarantine. And and that that quarantine is actually in the Bible that when whenever you are sick or you've got to isolate yourself, especially, yeah, lalo na kung matindi na yung iyong karamdaman, katulad ng leprosy. Oh, anyway, that's another topic that we need to discuss. But quarantine is is suggested so that you can be able to protect yourself and most especially you are able to protect others okay actually yun ang pinakamatindi hindi para sa iyo para sa iba kung ikaw ay responsable yun yun yeah how i wish i can share with you yung experience namin lahat naman kami affected na pero gayon pa man di ba kailangan pa rin ng God is so good, okay, that in our isolation, we were together. <laughs> Nakakita na kayo ng gano'n? Isolated together. <laughs> Parang yung aming pinapromote natin sa ating uh, community that we have uh, praying together alone. Uh, iba naman yun, hindi naman siya quarantine, ano? But praying together alone. Or better yet, praying alone together. Yan. Ang tawag namin dyan ay common prayer time. O, di ba katugtog ng, katu, ano katunog na ng quarantine? O, common prayer time. Okay, we have that. We pray alone, but we are together. And that's actually the quarantine and the quarantine time that God wants to have with you. Would you be? Hindi naman kailangan na magkasakit pa hindi naman kailangan na ma-infect pa. ba? But you've got to do that. Maybe, I, I know you're doing that in your in your own prayer time. You're having that quarantine time with God. And as you practice that, I know you have been allowing God to speak to you. And as God speaks to you, you hear Him because you have a humble heart. Okay? Only a humble heart will hear when God would speak. Yeah. We make decisions with our heart. Remember that. Okay? Make decisions with your heart and use your mind to make it work out. Ganun siya bali. Okay? Hindi ginagamit yung isip at saka ibababa sa puso. Magkaka problema yon. Dapat you make a decision with your heart and then use your mind to make it work out. Okay? So even even with with the with the time that we have with God which we call a quarantine Come on, maximize it by allowing God to speak to you, allowing God to lead you, guide you, 
allowing God to direct you, instruct you, and even correcting you. Yes, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Amen. Lord, you allow quarantine so that you may be able to speak to us as you isolate us, O Lord God, from the rest. We are not isolated totally because you are with us and you 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 connect with us, O Lord God, so that we will be connected properly to you in this quarantine time. So Lord, continue to uh, mold us and fashion us into into the person that you want us to be, especially when we are in our quarantine time. We pray this for your glory with Mama Mary praying with us and for us. In Jesus Christ's name, Amen and Amen. Okay? So, in your quarantine time, God is with you. So, enjoy Him. God bless you.